And I'm wondering if someone offered you to possibly, um, you know, would Marky Mark make a... Re What's more, I'm contemplating whether somebody offered you to conceivably, um, you know, would Marky imprint make a return. I might express want to be cautious with what we're hearing in light of the fact that clearly individuals are very much like keeping on to this. They see open doors for consideration. And it just took my breath away in a stunning disclosure that has shaken the hip jump world imprint Wahlberg, has released a stunner about his past in rap leaving everybody humming. You will have a hard time believing the stunning explanation you don't completely accept that the stunning purpose for his sudden exit from the music scene. And it's undeniably connected to, in all honesty, P. Diddy as tails twirl and hypothesis spins out of control, we dig into Wahlberg's surprising vocation turn. And its possible association with a debate encompassing Diddy's fights in court race yourselves for the hazardous subtleties that could reshape all that you assumed you had some awareness of these industry heavyweights. Imprint Wahlberg's introduction to the rap scene was out and out transient, naturally introduced to an extreme Boston area Wahlberg's excursion to fame, was however wild as it might have been momentous. Hello, yo, what's up? This is me, mock my man, HB. And you're chilling in group fit exiting secondary school very early on. He wound up trapped in a twisting of substances and negligible wrongdoing, yet destiny had different designs for him with his more seasoned sibling Donnie's rising distinction in the 80s sensation newcomer's imprint was moved into the music business. I understand what it resembles to be in a difficult situation. You understand what I mean. I understand what it resembles to be unfortunate. I understand what it's prefer to have cash, yet it's simpler for me. Instead of like the new messes with you understand, what I mean collaborating with a group of artists Wahlberg turned into the frontman for Marky Imprint. And the crazy bee punches magnetic stage presence and readiness to bear everything straightforwardly because of his famous Calvin Klein clothing promotions. Launch him to begin them anyway discussion before long followed in the midst of embarrassments and legitimate difficulties, including attack charges and allegations of bigotry and homophobia, Wahlberg's music vocation arrived at a defining moment. And I've been the pessimistic street. And I've been the good street. And I could never surrender the good street. Never I could never confronted with public examination. And individual strife Wahlberg settled on an urgent choice to reevaluate him self-driving behind his marky imprint persona. He wandered into acting a move that would rethink his profession direction in spite of beginning wariness Wahlberg, disproved his fault finders with stand-up exhibitions in films like Renaissance Man Dread and the widely praised Woogie Nights. Yet it was only after he featured close by George Clooney in Three Rulers and procured an Oscar designation for his job in Martin Scores that withdrew that Wahlberg cemented his status as a Hollywood heavyweight, changing flawlessly between classifications. He displayed his flexibility in shows like the contender comedies like Different Folks and Rush like Max Pay. Yet in the midst of his Hollywood achievement, Wahlberg's rap roots never blurred totally away from plain sight reports world about his unexpected exit from the music scene with murmurs of incomplete business and unsettled clashes and presently with his stunning disclosure connecting his flight too. As a matter of fact, P. Diddy, the situation starts to get interesting. Could Wahlberg's choice to leave rap behind be associated with a debate encompassing Diddy's fights in court? And I generally needed to in any case do music. I could never take a film for cash since I felt like I expected to develop as an entertainer, and I truly be not kidding about it, digging further into this tangled snare of theory sources near Wahlberg, indicate a hazier side of the music business one that he supposedly saw firsthand during his time in the rap game, as per these murmurs Wahlberg's dissatisfaction, originated from the overabundances and debasement he saw inside the business, especially inside circles, firmly connected with P. Diddy. He saw things that made him question all that one insider revealed talking on State of Anonity. It wasn't just about the music any longer. It was about influence impact 
and the hazier side of notoriety. Without a doubt, Wahlberg's own encounters shed light on the turbulent idea of the music business. For his fleeting ascent with Marky imprint and the crazy pack to the debates and legitimate difficulties that played his profession, he had seen everything, except it was maybe his experiences with Diddy that had the most profound effect reports recommend that Wahlberg's yearnings for his music vocation conflicted with the assumptions for his record name pushing him toward a junction where imaginative. Respectability slammed into business intrigues. I figure I might have been significantly more fruitful had I been permitted to do what I needed to do Wahlberg, reflected in a genuine meeting. Yet when they kept on driving me further the other way, that is the point at which I chose not to make one more record this strain between imaginative independence and industry pressures, arrived at a limit for Wahlberg, driving him to move back from the rap scene through and through yet. Which job did he play in this story of thwarted expectation and flight? How have he got it he utilized it and made millions off of it that assist him with being a very rich person? And afterward, he going to give them back with nothing in the tank? Some spay conjecture that Diddy's impact, both as a guide figure and a titan of the music business, might have molded Wahlberg's direction. Unexpectedly, their coordinated effort on an elite execution soluble water adventure denoted the start of an expert relationship, yet bits of gossip continue of a more profound association that stretches out past business. Could Diddy's supposed contribution in Wahlberg's choice to leave her out behind be established in something more vile murmurs of compulsion and control, twirl around their affiliation, indicating a more obscure underside underneath the gulfs and style of the diversion world? He's colloquialism, terrible kid. We know it's awful kid you bits of hearsay coursing inside industry circles. Propose that Diddy known for his essential moves and iron-fisted command over his realm was not satisfied with just teaming up with Wahlberg. Rather theory flourishes that did try to fix his grasp on the rising star directing terms and applying impact over Wahlberg's imaginative. Hadding the thought that didn't agree with the savagely free Wahlberg, for sure Diddy standing as a wise finance manager with an affinity for utilizing his influence to additional his own advantages posed a potential threat in the background of their expert connection, with murmurs of Diddy's inclination to use his impact as a weapon against the people who thought for even a second to go against him. It's easy to envision the tension Wahlberg may have looked to conform to his requests in an industry where coalitions are fashioned and broken quickly the idea of Diddy holding influence over Wahlberg's profession choices portrays the influence elements at play in the background. Could Wahlberg's unexpected exit from the rap scene have been a determined move to reduce most, if not all, connection with Diddy Impact, subsequently shielding his independence and imaginative trustworthiness? And that was all there was to it, be straightforward with it. And he can't be straightforward with it. Late improvements shed a chilling light on the shadowy underside of Diddy's realm. Confronting a flood of common claims, a